Pisces, this is a message for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Um, I'm talking about a Pisces who has a partner at the moment. So I'm going to have a look at a Pisces love relationship and I'm going to see what's going on in their relationship at the moment. So today I'm picking up a very conflicted energy. Um, someone doesn't know what the problem is. They're going through a lot of conflict with their partner at the moment they just feel like something isn't right um i also get that the person doesn't want to really be with them and that's why they feel like that the person is really trying to get away from them at the moment and staying away from them and it's kind of like a mind game where they're keeping away from the person but they're not telling them. So the person's kind of blinded to the situation. They don't know why they're treating them like this. They have no idea what's going on. I'm just picking up a lot of Pisces, Cancer and Scorpio energy because there's a lot of water in the cards that I've drawn today. So I'm feeling like this person has no idea. They're quite blind to this other person's motive as to what they're actually doing with them at the moment. So it's just keeping them in a conflict kind of energy. Yeah, this person isn't offering you anything. It's just keeping it all to itself, kind of selfish and mean kind of energy that I'm feeling here. Yeah, this person's, to me, it's to do with money, some situation with money, finances. They're all being kept to themselves. They're not really showing you anything, telling you a thing about money. But it seems like they have an awful lot and they're just keeping it all to themselves. Quite a mean and greedy, spiteful, selfish energy that I'm feeling here with the, this person. Yeah, I'm feeling like this person's just keeping everything hidden. They're not telling you a thing. They're keeping it all to themselves. They're not, they're not offering their you anything basically they're just keeping you there at the moment and um, this person's quite focused on their own pentacle they're just focused on their self they're focused on where they're going what they're doing they're just being quite greedy and mean at the moment to this person yeah i'm feeling like this person's holding on to their cash they're not showing that they've got a penny they're just acting quite broke you know, keeping it all to their self for their future. They know what they want to do, but it doesn't seem to include you. So they're being quite mean and withholding money, just not telling you a thing about any money at all. Yeah, so I'm getting your thoughts are quite conflicted at the moment. You, you just keep overthinking what have I done? What what could it be? What What is it? What's the issue? You know, you just keep having self-doubt and wondering what you've done wrong to deserve this kind of person in your life. You generally love this person, but this person just withholding too much from you. So you're just overthinking, wondering what's hidden, what, what you don't know. Yeah, this person just focused on their self, basically. They're just focusing on all of their self and what they're doing with their lives. They're not really including you in any of it, so... You feel a bit sad that you just, you can see them doing this. You're actually watching them do this. So, you know, you're not really saying much. You're just overthinking, overthinking. I'm also getting that regardless of what happens with this person, you're going to be divinely protected because you fight, fought all the battles that you could have possibly been through in your life. The angels are protecting you. God's protecting you. Your spirit God, your ancestors your angels are protecting you at the moment so whatever happens in this situation you'll be fine so don't worry just try not to worry too much and let's see if i get any more cards for you on that situation
Yeah, so I'm getting this person's taking all of their swords and they're kind of keeping them all to their soul. They're just looking back at you, but slightly thinking, you know, I'm going to grab my swords and I'm going to run because it's not for me. It's not what I want. So I'm just focusing all on myself and what I want and my thoughts and feelings. I'm not really caring about this person's feelings or emotions at the moment. Just for you. One last shuffle of the deck and then I'll see and round up this reason for you. No message as to what price you should do next. Any more messages as to what Yeah, I'm getting that you're the magician, so regardless of this situation, you're going to come out okay. You're going to find what you need to do. You're going to know which way to go. You're going to manifest a better life for yourself. So you don't need to worry about this situation as much as you are. I think I'm getting that overthinking is quite stressful and it is, you know, feeling like a manipulative energy coming from this person. But at the same time, you, your intuition's on point. You know, you know, you know what you want to do for your future anyway. It's sad that you might not end up spending it with this person, but at the same time, you can make your own dreams come true. So without them, you'll be fine. So try not to worry too much on this person because, you know, when something bad's taken away from you, something good comes into your life. So regardless of this situation, you're going to be the magician who will make your own dreams come true. So thank you, Pisces, for watching. Please like, share and subscribe if you like my channel. But thank you for even just watching my channel because it's all new to me and I've just started and I really want to know if this resonates with anyone or you know if this is your situation just let me know and hit the notification bell too but thank you so much Pisces for taking your time to watch this reading and I'll see you again soon bye